Ooh, British girls. I think she looks like the American girl or the the Russian girl or the Saudi Arabian girl. I think it might be the same girl. Oh. I'm just going through my my pre-race routine. Yep, yep. Hey, that is not what I look like. One second behind. All right. Uh, yeah. Race strategy. Who needs a race strategy? Let's just do the race. Let's get the cursor on the right screen. Okay, here we go. Hey, it's KMA, by the way. Warning, collision with my own teammate. That warning should be you're kicked off the team. <laughs> Not a warning in the race. <laughs> what? You just hit Hamilton? No, 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 no. You all done, guy. You think you're going to race again in the world of F1? Uh-uh, uh-uh. Yes, Louise. I didn't do that at all during practice. It's a third. Well, yo, sorry, Hamilton. Yeah, what you said, whatever that was. But the good thing is, is usually my problem with these races is that is that I crash. And then the rest of the race is me trying to catch up to how I failed. Um, I'm in first place, so there should be no reason for me to crash. Other than not paying attention. Which never happens to me. <laughs> Alright. Enough with the BS, right? Well, that was a wide turn. That's not how you're gonna do it. Uh, well, are you? Are you? That wasn't no overtaking. You did what I did to Hamilton to me. You're, you're lucky I, I respect you. You, in that red race car, you. I respect you enough to pass you? Oh gosh. That's right. Hey, you're gonna send me flying, you. You got a faster car than me. Well, don't wanna hit another car and then have the screen freeze on me. Whoa, there's another guy there. I'm trying not to crash, especially with my own teammate. Yeah, yeah. I gotta learn how to do that first turn right. Obviously, I'm messing it up. Or maybe this track just has my number and I just don't get it. Get out of my way, you. Oh, 
Sorry guys, just uh, a little bit of an intense racing. I, I really want to actually uh, not crash while racing with these guys, and I really got to figure out how to do that turn. I lose more st more on that one turn than I do the rest of the race combined. Uh-oh, what am I doing? Cutting corners. Big time, whoa. <laughs> Wait a second, I, I got to re remind myself I am not a rally racer. <laughs> I do not race on dirt right now. But I was kind of trying to get up to these guys. No, 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 no. They're not allowed to freeze every two or three seconds. I don't see what I'm doing. Those little lag spikes are happening in the game too, so I'm having a little trouble. What the hell? Whoa, I hate when my computer does that. Okay. Sorry guys there. Something's going on. That Something's going on in the background of my computer. Um, I just took my mouse off the game, so I had nothing. So, even though without a crash, I'm still in a situation where I'm gonna have to do a lot of catching up. That really sucks. It happens during Minecraft every once in a while, is I'll be just playing the game and all of a sudden I start doing something in the the mouse is on another program that's hidden in the background, like something updated or something, and it's just not cool. And that happened there, so I'm trying to turn and race, and all I'm doing is slowing down and going off the road. So, um, we'll call that an unfortunate event, and we'll continue and do the best we can. So we got nine laps to get 15 positions. Is that possible, guys? What do you think? Leave your uh, comments below before the end of the race and tell me if you think I have the diseases to get at least some of these positions back. The diseases. A little too wide there. It was like something broke in my car and I couldn't steer anymore and the acceleration stopped working. That's so sad. I really wanted to do well in this race. But you know, um, in racing, just like any other games you play in a professional level, things happen that you can't be in control of and we'll call what happened to me losing the ability to use my main screen there for five seconds um, we'll call that an unfortunate event that I am just gonna have to recover from which I can do That's a nice set of curves there. If I have that down perfectly, I could do a lot of damage there. Yeah, I, I'm not corner cutting. How, how can driving on grass be corner cutting? All right, people are already pitting. I don't understand that. 
I'm gonna finish lap seven before I do that. Oh. Hey, it looks like New England in the middle of a season change. Must be England. Or in a normal day, overcast, no sun, probably drizzling. Yo, frickin' game is uh, freezing at all the wrong times. The only thing I can think of is that I, is I got a Chrome browser open, and Chrome's messing with the game. Hey, that's right. Give him the hand. We're gonna go into the pits now. So when I come out, it will. Whoa. When I come out, it will be the seventh lap. Thirty-seven miles per hour through the pits. How specific? All right. I was gonna say maybe I should close that browser now while I'm in the pits, but these pits are quick. This pit stop brought to you by Rolex, 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 Rolex. The watch I'll never buy because one, I don't like watching watches, watches, watches. I don't like watching watches. I don't like wearing watches. And what I mean about watching watches is when I do have a watch on, I tend to look at the time all the time. Come on, guy. We got the same tires on. Mine are just as cold as yours, and I can do better than that. All right. Get. That's right. I'm going to hit you again. Oh, turn, car. Turn. Through everything. Turn, turn, turn. Oh, boy. That turn, I tell ya. You mean there's a yellow flag without me <laughs> being the cause? Whoa! Oh! Wow! Dang, man! Whoa, I got, I just got, uh, warning, that was not me. I got repaid for my touch on the other guy. I was not expecting that. You know, when you see replays and those accidents when somebody's doing like 100 miles per hour slower than everybody else, and you're like, how could they possibly hit that person? But I know from real life and this game that when you're doing a hundred miles faster than somebody else you really come up to them pretty quick oh I'm not saying that I've done a hundred miles per hour faster than somebody else in real life yep not at all Um, let's just say I've been pulled over for doing 100 miles over the speed limit before. <sighs> Serves me right, right there. I remember I had a mid-70s Chevy Note. Oh my god. This is it. Oh. 
Jeez, I start talk. Whoa, there it goes again. Come back onto my screen. I'm not recording this again with Google. The hell. I don't know, everything's like, oh, change to Google, change to Google, and I finally switched over to Google Browser, and it's like the biggest, eh, power-hungry little browser there is. I stick with my browser from now on. Google, if, well, actually, my scheduling is on Google, so that's why it's open. I gotta figure out what I'm doing today, scheduling-wise. But boy, oh boy, oh boy. This has been a race of uh, things I can't control. But yeah, like I, what I was saying was I, I had a mid 70s Chevy Nova. And um, I was driving it <laughs> for, let's see, uh, pretty long distance from Boston, well, actually north of Boston to. Miami the following day, but my radiator had kicked out so I I bought a radiator and I threw it in there and the, the hard part with radiators is that the radiator could be in there properly But the hoses might leak a little bit. So I wanted to push my vehicle um, Before I went on this long trip to Florida to make sure the radiator hoses were on there so I drove up from to New Hampshire and back in the middle of the night um, with the car as fast as I possibly could. I was, a, I was a stupid 20 year old. And I was on Route 1 in Saugus, Massachusetts and I get pulled over in a 45 mile per hour zone doing 152. <laughs> and um, This was back in the 90s, early 90s, and the police were a little bit different back then. The guy looked at me and says, you know how fast you're going? I told him the story. I'm like, I'm pushing my car. It's, it's the middle of the night. I just, just nobody out here. All stupid reasons. Um, and he pulled me over about two miles away from my house. He had me park the car, and he drove me home, and he gave me a ticket for doing 55 and a 45. Instead of giving me a ticket for doing 107 over the speed limit, he gave me a ticket for doing 10 over the speed limit. And I said, thank you very much. He says, don't you ever do that again, or else I will throw you in jail. <laughs> like, don't worry. When you have an old car that's supposed to have a straight six engine in it, and you throw a 357 Corvette engine in it, it it goes pretty fast. <laughs> it was also uh, had a clutch. Those big old American muscle cars did not used to have clutches for the most part. But even though it wasn't really a big old American muscle car, it was a Nova. Yeah, you can make them into big old American muscle cars if you wanted to. Mine, mine really wasn't. But, uh, I mean, it could do 150. <laughs> but then again, my 95 horsepower car that I drive now can probably do 130 just because it's so light. One, I want to get a good pass going. It's not like I'm doing 193. It's unfortunate that those issues happened during this race. Definitely gonna have to. I don't know. It didn't happen during the practice. Whoa! Come on. But I imagine there's only a few more races in this um, championship season, and I'm not gonna win it if I keep having these 
things happen. Which will make me want to do another season of this, but um, I am going to be buying Forza 4, and I want to do my next vehicles thing on Forza 4. Um, because I've always liked that type of racing more than F1 type style racing, but I've definitely gotten into the F1 style. I pay attention to it more now in real life. And, um... Yeah, I, I, thanks to Sheep Machine, I've gotten into F1. Not tremendously, but uh, more than I ever have in my life. Yeah, yeah. I'm from New England, we cheat. I need some guys to pit because everybody else is way ahead of me. be able to see the cars before the end of the race it's too bad because this is usually when I do my best and if the races were longer I would definitely be probably winning them at some point if I can get through them without crashing so maybe not I guess I'm a crasher always been a crasher Whenever I've done racing games in the past, it's always been pushing my way through the field, which is why I struggle so much with this game, because you can't really do that. Is that my corner cut in the corner? Probably. Okay, we're gonna be taking it right up here. Oh, I see, I see cars. No, I did not just run off the track. Not at all. Alright. One more lap, guy. Let's do the best lap possible. Yeah, my tires are sucking. Yeah, at least my teammate won. Wow, look at all this time. I was doing replays um, at the end of the races, but I decided I'm going to stop trying to do that. Oh. For one, somebody sees a 40 minute video and goes, ugh, <laughs> because I know I do that. Um, for two, I'm not racing well enough to watch replays. <laughs> Wall out of 18. Oh my god. Well, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, you better not be shaking your fist and being all happy. You be, should be like throwing your helmet and kicking the car. Actually, throwing your helmet and kicking the computer.
You know, I got zero points there. Let's see how I am for the season. I'm 47 points back. Yeah, I'll take that. Objective failed. Mm -hmm. Well, guys, have a great day. Thank you for watching this. And uh, next week we'll be someplace else, right? Where are we going? I don't want to see the replay. I just want to see where we're going to be playing next. Damn, that, that sucked. All right, guys. Have a great day. Thank you for watching. And... I don't know. I'll see you next next time. Goodbye.